So I'm here again with Steve Kendall from Learn360. Last time we were together we just kind of learned a little bit about the tool and now we are learning a little bit more about how it works. Um, so one of the things that you mentioned to me was the ability and power for the tool to be able to create playlists and organize from these massive libraries of professionally produced media sure. and basically mark it up so that your students can interact with it. Yeah, in the classroom a teacher doesn't necessarily want to go searching for three eight thousand videos in right. you, know, you want to do that in advance and get prepared. So we have the ability to be able to go in, search for content, and save that content into packets and folders and files, assignments, things like that, yeah. that will enable that content to be efficiently used in the classroom or at home. So we created something just a little bit ago, but say for example we're doing something on, I don't know, World War II. Okay. And uh, we want to add, you know, an article or uh, some more photos to a slideshow or even a video, a newsreel, great old sure. newsreel. How do we do that? Okay. Let me do, I'll show you that. I'll do a quick search on World oh, great. War II. We'll, we'll post okay. And I love that as you search, you can choose your grade level. Three to five, six to eight, you know, nine through twelve, something for staff development. Very cool. Absolutely. And as your search hit here, I might point this out, um, it breaks it out. You can actually go, well, I want stuff that's appropriate for my 6th to 7th to 8th grade. Sure. So why don't we go there? We can okay. see over here, now that we've done a search on World War II, we see that we have 2,000 results. Way overwhelming. You want to yeah. narrow that search result down to something. But if we're looking at middle school, we've already narrowed that down to 248 results. Our area here continue narrowing by enables us now to refine our search Excellent. and become uh, much more specific in terms of what it is that we're looking for that, that we want to use in the classroom. All right, so you get this great video on Europe and the people, the nationalist tensions, very cool stuff. Great, yeah, so we can see that this is a 16 minute, 16 minute, 43 minute clip from the full video, Europe the People, it was produced by Academic Media Network in 2005. Very Excellent. Current, very current. It's aligned to uh, Idaho content standards, and you can search for uh, search by uh, content standards right here. So, so essentially, what that's going to do is it's going to save all the videos that I'd like to see into a specific playlist that I've called World War II, right. and I'm simply going to add that to this playlist. Now, it's very very cool. Yeah. Well, thank you very much for showing this. Um, and we'll try to get you out here again and, and bug you and ask some more questions in the future. But thanks a lot. It. It's you. Learn 360, and this is Steve Kendall. Thank you.